In this video, we are going to learn about pheochromocytoma. This is the tumor arising from adrenal gland or suprarenal gland which lies above the kidney. Cross section of suprarenal gland shows an outer part called adrenal cortex and inner part called adrenal medulla. The medulla is composed of chromaffin cells that secrete catecholamines and the tumor arising from these cells is called pheochromocytoma. The chromaffin cells are also found in other areas like organ of Jocker candle, urinary bladder, paraaortic areas and sometimes in the neck as well. Now the tumor arising from chromaffin cells on these areas are called paragangliomas or extra adrenal pheochromocytoma. Pheochromocytoma occurs in association with the following hereditary syndromes. First we have multiple endocrine neoplasia 2A also known as Sipple syndrome or multiple endocrine neoplasia 2B. It is an autosomal dominant disorder associated with an activating germline mutation of the RET proto-oncosine on chromosome 10. Next one is von Hippel-Lindau's disease. It is also an autosomal dominant disorder associated with an inactivating mutation of the von Hippel-Lindau tumor suppressor gene on chromosome 3. Next is von Recklinghausen's disease or neurofibromatosis type 1. This is also an autosomal dominant disorder associated with an inactivating mutation of the NF1 tumor suppressor gene on chromosome 17. Pheochromocytoma is a tumor arising from chromaffin cells and chromaffin cells secrete catecholamines. So this is a catecholamine secreting tumor and catecholamines include adrenaline, noradrenaline and dopamine. It could be benign or malignant. However, it's very difficult to differentiate these two on the basis of histology. The definitive diagnosis of malignancy in pheochromocytoma is based exclusively on the presence of metastasis, which may involve regional lymph nodes, liver, lung, and bone. Something called rule of 10 can be applied in case of pheochromocytoma for better understanding of the tumor. Let's see what are they. 10% cases of pheochromocytoma are malignant. 10% occur in children. 10% tumor calcify. 10% are not associated with hypertension, which means 90% people with pheochromocytoma have hypertension. 10% are extra adrenal that is found in other organs rather than adrenal gland like organ of Jocker candle, bladder, etc. as I've explained earlier. 10% are familial cases and 10% of pheochromocytoma are bilateral, that is it occurs in both adrenal glands. And you can remember these as a mnemonic Master Chef Britain.
surgery, laparoscopic adrenalectomy for adrenal tumors performed by the transperitoneal or retroperitoneal route is the gold standard.